Recently, scientists in Chile stumbled upon something incredible during an expedition, a brand new species of sea lily. This wasn't just any sea lily, though. It was found way down south near Vega Island, chilling under the Antarctic ice. Now, this discovery might make you think of another cool critter, the Antarctic Feather Star. These guys are also echinoderms, just like the new sea lily, and they both belong to a group called crinoids. Crinoids use their many arms to move around and catch food particles floating by. So, are these new sea lilies just fancy feather stars? Well, probably not. Even though they're close relatives, there are likely some key differences between the two. Imagine it like this, you and your cousin might share some features, but you probably have different hairstyles or favorite foods, right? The same could be true for these crinoids. They might have variations in things like size, number of arms, or the way they feed. Finding this new sea lily species is a big deal because it shows us just how much life is still waiting to be discovered in the deep ocean, even in harsh environments like Antarctica.